Linux experiences on Deck Edition. Let's have a look at Titanfall 2 and especially at the North Star mod for Titanfall 2 that allows you to join private servers. The online servers for the official multiplayer are not really working anymore. So we can be happy that there is a mod that allows us to host private servers and join them, even though those modes that you can play on those private servers are only pvp modes no pve modes but hey the game is a lot of fun and if you have a few people to play on a server it is a great experience i've played this on the desktop already for a while but we are going now to follow a guide that is available to install the mod on the steam deck the guide is on the north star wiki and they even have a special steam deck guide and the things we have to do is to start the game once, that's what we are going to do in a bit, and then install a Proton Glorious Egg Roll version because those are needed for the mod as the official Proton versions are not working with the mod. So let's start the game once on the Steam Deck to make sure the Proton prefix is created properly. This is a fresh install, so it will install Origin. The game itself is marked as playable because we have to install Origin. Uh, I don't want to shortcut, no menu, <laughs> not when Windows starts. Keep Origin and my games up to date, yes, and they totally should know that I'm playing this on the deck. So we are sharing the hardware specifications. We don't have to enter any credentials. Steam is taking care of connecting us. All right. And even though the multiplayer entry is available, probably that won't work. But we are just doing this for creating the Proton Prefix. We are now quitting the game again. And we are switching to the desktop. Here we start the Discover App Store and search for Proton up, that's enough, and we find the Proton up QT package. We install this. This is available in the utilities tab. And let's drag this window a little bit bigger. So we have to add a new version, I guess. Proton E. And the recommended version here is 73-GE-1. So install this. We can close this then. And then we have to download the North Star mod in Firefox here. We can Google for North Star GitHub. And this will come up with the North Star GitHub page. We are here even directly on the release page. And here we can download the North Star release. We save this at first. Then we can open this. 
will open down here. And this now we have to extract into the Titanfall 2 folder. And we read that by opening Steam with the library. Right click on the Titanfall 2 entry, go to properties, local files, browse. This will open the Titanfall 2 folder. We can click in the bar here, mark all of these. Right click, copy, go back to the archive tool, go to extract. And here, right click, paste, click on the check mark. And we don't want to have this extracted into a subfolder. And extract. So we see now that the files are here available. The next thing we have to do is to rename or to link the Nowstar launcher to the Titanfall 2 EXE. Now we create a duplicate of this file to save it. Duplicate here. Then we need this name, so we right click, rename, mark all of it, right click, copy, right click, move to trash. Right click into empty space, create new, link to file or directory. Name for the link will be Titanfall 2. And we are linking to a file to the North Star Launcher EXE. Okay. And this should be it. Let's go back into the gaming mode. Now we have to change the options for Titanfall 2. We have to select a special Proton version. And this is even the correct entry already selected. Perfect. We go back. And now we should be able to start this. They said this might take a long time for the first setup, so we will wait. Five minutes later. And here we go. Thanks for installing Northstar. Here we go. And now, and here we see the server browser and we see servers. So when we select one, we have to press the D pad to the right, and then A to connect. And we connect it actually to a Northstar private server. Performance is great on deck. Reaching even 60 FPS, wow. Using the default controls here. Now I just need to get good with the controls. But that's a different topic. The game does work. <laughs> with great performance and it works even with the mod. Thank you so much for watching. I will leave this match now. Thank you so much for watching. See you on the next video. Have a good one and bye bye.